already my parents had, you know, tried to give me lessons. They gave my sister lessons, and she used to practice. But when I, when I got the music that the teacher gave me, it was like da 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 with one hand, and that's what it was. And so I thought, that's kind of, um, what are they doing here? That isn't what I heard. That isn't what I want to do. So, of course, I wouldn't play the piano. But um, one day, I used to like to stay home because I could be alone. They would go out and do things, the family would. Um, so I found these recordings that they had. They were on, a, I think it was like a 33 size record. These were breakable things. And uh, we had a, uh, a record player, so I put it on the record player, and I thought, ah, this sounds pretty good, this music. So it happened to be Frankie Carl. Um, I guess uh, a lot of people don't know who he is, so I should probably explain. He's, it sounded like he was inspired by Fats Waller. So that was the kind of feeling, uh, kind of calmed down Fats Waller, but that was great for me. Um, because the city that I lived in had 17,000 people and uh, there was no jazz, there was nothing like that that I would ever hear or hear about. So uh, I listened to it and I said, oh, now I can find it on the piano. It's a piano playing, we've got a piano, and so I figured out how to do it. And in the maybe three months of instruction of da 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 da, I learned how to read both the treble clef and the bass clef. So I knew how to figure out how to write music. So what I would do is just copy the whole, every note in the right hand and the left hand and uh, play it on the piano, memorize it. How old were you? Well, by the time I was finished with it, I did about eight of them. And, um, and then I was 11 